tonight was Queen, sure. You and I, we probably about the same age. You said you grew up listening to Queen. I did. So how was tonight to dance to it? It was so much fun. Uh, yeah, I genuinely love Queen so much, and I just really, really love all their music. Just some of the most iconic songs, like, ever to date. So, yeah, to celebrate that. Which one's your that, favorite? Well, now I feel biased, and I'm going to say Fat Bottom Girls, because we just did a dance to it, and... I also really, really loved that song before dancing to it, which was exciting. But then, of and course, now you got three tenths to that song. I know. So, so final answer, Fat Bottom yeah. Girls. <laughs> and so tonight, you guys got not one, not two, not three, but four bonus points. Oh. <laughs> yes. Talk about that. You get a bonus point. You, you get, get a, a bonus, bonus point. That was really like surprising to me. I totally yeah. didn't expect that. So very excited, obviously, and you know just. I thought our group was so much fun too, even just yeah. in rehearsals when we'd be camera blocking together, just the energy was so amazing. So it, I think everybody honestly had so much fun and what a great reward for yes. the bonus points. Super fun, super grateful. I mean, we had mm -hmm. a very competitive team. Totally. Um, and yeah, it was it was conflicting because we were rooting for each other, you know? Yeah. And, uh, felt, I wanted to share all those points, but you know, it feels it feels great. It, yeah. it feels better even to hear the the feedback. You know, the totally. judges were really complimentary of her frame and how far she's come, and, and that's really all we want. Yeah, the judges really showed you a lot of love tonight. Like, how did that feel? Oh my gosh, we've it been feels... we've been giving him candy all week. Yeah. <laughs> no, it feels it feels amazing. I. I've said this before, I'll say it again, I grew up watching the show, so to even be dancing in front of them is such like a huge privilege and honor, and yeah, just to hear great feedback and also the constructive criticism that I'm also getting is making me become a better dancer, and I'm really grateful for that. And obviously this one's helping me a little bit too. <laughs> okay, and switching gears, let's talk about your new podcast. What kind of reaction have you been getting from that? I think a good one. Um, I'm really excited about it, and I think that I just I'm just excited to have a platform to open up a little bit more and to get to know other people too. And um, yeah, I had Val on my last episode, which was really fun and very natural. Probably and the best episode she's ever, done so far. Ever. Um, yeah. So yeah, it's been really really great. I think it's cool to, you know, have the voices of the next generation have a have a platform and have a say, and also have a fairly cool perspective you know she she has a lot of smart things to say and I'm, I'm glad that she has a platform to share Thanks. yeah and I also know you know how lucky I am to have that platform so it'll be a work in progress and I just obviously started and I've never done something like this and interviewed people I don't know how you do it um, but yeah I just want to use it wisely and yeah talk about some good topics have people on there that have a big impact on society and See where it kind of takes me. And although it's new to you, it has to be still liberating to be able to to talk about your own life, to tell your own narrative without anyone else, right. and to of course interview others. Like, how's that? Yeah, it's really, really great. I think for me, I for so long I haven't really tried or wanted to change any narratives. I'm just letting you know life and the universe kind of pan out. And now I just feel like I'm older. I've grown up, and I just want to use it for like the benefit of others as well. And I know a lot of my audience is like around my age or you know, at that formative time where you might need like a therapist or somebody on there, which was my first episode. So I kind of want to start getting people on too that help others. Um, so that's a big goal of mine, but it feels good. Yeah, yeah, okay, last question. Sure. <laughs> Next week, yes. Jenny Jackson. That is epic. Yeah. You have to get that right. Yeah, you see. Pressure. Yeah, you're going to have to get that right. I know. I'll let you take this one away. Are you nervous? I mean, you, you killed it with the flat bottom girl. It's fat bottom girl, right, and right, he right, mocks right, me right, because right, they right, gave right, it right. to the no, one contestant I, no. that's. I'm just saying, Janet Jackson keeper. is going to be a lot of soul, a lot of swag, a lot of. Yeah, it's just. it's. It, it's a, lot. It's a whole lot happens. of women she's going to have to bring. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it's going to be it's going to be a challenging week, I'm sure, but I'm excited. Super excited we're still in this, so hopefully we surprise people. Yes. I don't know the dance yet, so I can't really speak on it, but I'm very excited. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for watching. If you want more extra, hit the subscribe button and the bell so you'll never miss a video.